We're living and alive, Alex O'Neill. We're yes, live. Mike, take me to the Wild West. We're we're heading to the Wild West, but we're also heading to the near future, and maybe wow. even the distant future. The distant future. It's all possible here in Live Alive. Our li- Live Alive, Live Alive. People have, have this game's been out long live enough. People, live. people get it. They know the they know the yeah. video game. So this is yeah, you know yeah this. so this is like a uh, was a prop popular not like a more like I guess like a more like a, a niche kind of cult hit back from the SNES that released only in Japan. Um, it didn't come to the states till now, as far as I'm aware. I'm pretty sure that's what I've seen. Yeah. Um, and yeah, they remade it in the two HD two D kind of style of Octopath Traveler. Um, and you kind of have these. Basically, you have eight separate separate stories of these different characters. I've done two of them so far. Um, you see, I've done Imperial China. Um, and wow. Prehistory is the other one I did. So, so China exists in this universe. Yeah, Imperial China exists. Edo Japan does exi- ex- exist as okay. well. Okay. Um, and then there's some other more like years near future. And I guess the Wild West as and, well. And so. the Wild West. Yeah, I've not <laughs> I've not jumped into these stories yet. The other stories yet. We're going to jump into one right now. So I was thinking either present day because there is present day mm. right now. I don't know. If, actually, I don't know if we want to do that. It's a pretty bad time in present day. Yeah. Some would say <laughs> rough. Um, let's 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 maybe check out the near future and see if it's any better. How do you, what do you say? We can. Yeah, that's fair. With this, with this flowing, this flowing probed anime man. And this went, very went, anime. Yeah, and, went, and then we pick it. It'll, it'll give us a little synopsis here. So here we go. One day soon, but not yet, a rebellious youth lives a hard life, getting into trouble and picking fights because he knows what others are thinking. A rough routine, but one to which he has grown accustomed. Okay. However, okay. his power eventually leads him to become involved in a dark conspiracy. Oh no. Um, which he can only be stopped through the resurrection of an ancient robot king, the Steel Titan. Oh jeez. Right, there you go. Let's let's see what's up here in the near future, shall we? That's like a lot up front, you know. Like yeah, all of a sudden, all of a sudden, we're 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 gonna be a part of resurrecting this titan of something of some kind. I'm glad it's during the day because that like knocking on the door sound would have scared the ever loving <laughs> crap out of me at night. <laughs> at night times in the silence. Oh. So tell me, anime eyes. So tell me, you happy with your lot in life? Oh, there's voice acting in this game. Yep, there is. There's. There's. Full, most of the characters are fully voiced. Yeah, it's pretty. It's been pretty good so far. Um, That's you happy cool. with your life, man? I was not expecting to answer these kind of questions. Yeah, heavy. Um, Let's uh, say not exactly because we're we're playing this yeah, character, right? Yeah, no, not exactly. Let's see what we got here. Well, ain't that a shame? Still, it is. Got there's em. only one person who can fix that. That's you. Wow, important life no lesson come here. To the rescue. It's your life to live. And to change, you have to life to live, life alive. Yeah, that's right. Preachy, though I suppose I kind of did. Yeah, you already kind of did. But hear me out. Eyes it's in the, the darkness. <laughs> Anime man. Yeah. Maybe he's just looking at himself in the mirror. Yeah, something like that. Or he's always thinking to himself. Maybe here we go. Waking up on a park bench. It's a good vibe. It's grassy. Good to know mm-hmm. the near future has trees still. Yes, they're still out, outdoors. Is okay. Oh, I mean, yeah. we're gonna flashback here. Shout out to the bull cut. Dad, where are you? Where's where is Dad? I wonder. Got some childhood trauma right out the gate. Yeah. You got it. You love to see it. Is this kind of similar to how some of the other stories started? Um, to to an extent, yes. <laughs> Um, some like I will say, the pre the prehistory one, um, which was again, it's it's like based about it's just like a story about all these it's like cavemen and like you know dinosaur almost era. But he didn't. Um, oh man, it's really dark. Like that didn't have, have any speaking lines at all. It was really just like oh. the characters like grunting and like putting right. little emotive fa- fa- like emoticons basically over their head. Down the um, for giant, most of it. The Crusaders. But the, the Edo Japan one was fully voiced and idea might turn out like, you know, you had characters interacting with each other. Cool. Up to him. Full Batman origin happening right before us. Yeah. So much. 
and then getting a, getting a lot of story set up here. I would definitely say this is a little bit definitely more story set up than the other two had right out the gate. Mm. We're getting this like character's backstory. Yeah, we're going through the whole okay, childhood right now. We have yeah. some new friends joining us today. Go on and introduce yourself to the others. Now he's now he's in class and he's. Let's see. Well, yeah, that's oh. right. We're Akira. Let's confirm it. <laughs> Akira. That's right. <laughs> Gonna look for Tetsuo, my brother. Tetsuo! Somebody give me a motorcycle. Yeah, 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 that's right. I want you all to do everything to make them feel welcome, okay? That's right. Welcome me as a young this youth. Is? These kids, they seem like good kids, well, except for that guy in the back left. Yeah, he's like not even paying he's attention. Cheating. He's looking at the wall back there. Uh, yes, miss! Watanabe. Watching you, Watanabe. That's right. I have so many questions already. Oh, here we are. Yeah, Hello again. Here again. Cody and I were sent to Bright Sparks Orphanage that I first noticed I was diff that I begun to develop some strange powers. The mutant gene. Yeah, yeah he has the, he has the gene. Even make things move without he has the X them. gene. Holy shit. X Men crossover pushing a button. Finally, the MCU like that, creeping into our video games. Thoughts, loud and clear. Press the Y button. Then. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Mind powers. Waves. Well, now he's echoey. So tell me, if you had the power to read people's minds, how would you use it? As for me, well... He's doing a... Do you, he's gonna do some shady stuff. Do the other characters have kind of like a unique... Um, so the, the, pre the like prehistory that. character did. Um, basically, what, the, what their thing was, was they had, a, they had an increased heightened sense of smell... So you can actually, mm. you know, you know, in a tr traditional old school JRPG sense, you know, you have random battles that are happening in that area that during that uh, sequence. But if you use your sniff, that actually makes dust clouds appear where those battles are. So you can technically avoid battles if you wanted to. In That's that kind of cool. And that was pretty cool. The other one didn't have that, but it was also like a little bit of a different setup because it wasn't random battles either. Like it was like characters out in the field and you can run up to them and, and like initiate a battle um so they all god this so, game is pretty yeah it's yeah it's a hd 2d it looks great the i love this style the, so much yeah, it's, the, it's a great style all of them have looked really nice like definitely i like the look of octopath but i think you know now that they've had octopath and can build off of that like it feels like a step up from that from my plate yeah which is less great. sheen going on right now yeah a lot, nice. a lot of yeah visual extra visual effects tied onto this so another thing i'll point out is the soundtrack is also extremely good in this because you yeah, know you got a good you, beat right you gotta, now you got a shout out to our lady yoko shimura she was uh the original composer yeah. for the original game and then she like this is all of her music like redone for this game and it's 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 fantastic um so you can see it looks like so you can speak to this guy let's let's first talk to him here he's an idle businessman so uh -huh. now we'll read his mind Oh shit. Being a salesman isn't all bad. I could never get away with playing hooky like this if I was chained to a desk. Alright, there you go. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Oh, hi, bird. Can you read the bird's mind? Yeah, it wouldn't. I don't think it would let me. Damn. They're, yeah, they're not. That's right, you it. have to, like, interact. So this is very, like, yeah. Octopath. I remember part of that yeah. game was that each character had their own, like, a dialogue ability or something. Yeah, they had, like, yeah, like, special abilities they could do. He could, he should, he, the hungry boy should go for some takoyaki right now. I feel that. Um, here's a lovely couple. Italian by the Bay Bridge. I'll be hitting up Juliana's in Hawaii. Seriously, you're such a cheapskate. Let's see wow. what she's saying. The time is right. No idea what's bugging her. Good deal. Uh, Yo, she's, she's gonna murder yeah, this she's, guy. She's, she's taking this. She's taking this businessman <laughs> out. Found its dating guy. Don't fit me now. <laughs> That's pretty good. Uh, That's so let's good. see what else is around here. Um, can't interact with that. Uh, so our flag is our main, our flag. That orange little flag there on the map below. Here's our main objective. Oh, this guy Got looks. It. This guy looks susp. It's got like it's a, a it's a goblin. 
Yeah, it's like a skull oh, mask. This is man. one of the Crusaders, I think, that gang that you're talking about. Yeah, maybe. Oh, oh, another one in the bush. Oh, we're being ambushed, I think. Uh oh, SpaghettiOs. Reading minds. Akira has a unique power to read minds. Yep. That's why near people to hear the secrets you never hear speak aloud when and learn surprising truths, they may, ha uh, may have valuable insights. There you go. Let's read, a Let's read his mind right out of the gate. Meet the quota, but this kid ought to do the trick. Oh, oh no. Helmeted, uh -oh. helmeted thug. They're coming for me. Screw you and your quota. I'm not going anywhere with you losers. Got him. What did you say to me? Oh. Here, motorcycle. Got a regular Edward Cullen on our hands. <laughs> Snap, look at that. Look at this dude. Yo. Badass. He's a badass biker. It's Tetsuo, dude. Holy <laughs> shit. He came. Since when did the Crusaders start snatching kids? Yeah, when did they start Who snatching the kids? You? I guess you're like a teenager. Yeah, I guess, yeah. Who am I? Isn't it obvious? I'm the badass biker. <laughs> exactly. I'm oh. a local businessman. He's a local businessman. <laughs> oh, combat time. Oh yeah, um, this is some good yeah. jam right here yeah, too. Yeah, this, this is a good combat jam here. So here you go. So the combat is basically like a tile-based thing. Um, oh. so, I'll, so I'll kind of explain it. Where you have, you know, the blue bars are the health. Then you have kind of the orange orange meter underneath that. That's basically like a time meter. So you can see mine's filled up. So now I can do an attack. If I were to move around tiles, the, all of their meters would start moving up as well. Um, so oh. you, so it's kind of a it's kind of a moving and positioning sort of style of combat. Um, so let's see what moves we have. I have a low kick. I can hit that Mother's guy. Shame. El elbow strike. Um, self care so I can heal. Think happy thoughts and restore a solid amount of HP. There you go. And they have much shames. I can hit a bunch of enemies with that. Confuse me with thoughts of their moms so they lose the will to fight. All right, I gotta do that when it says something like that. <laughs> yeah. Shut up already. Using my mind powers to. Mess with him. Oh, it took a that does two. damage too. too. Nice. So now he's affectionate. So now we got our badass biker. I got badass kicks. Gut punch. <laughs> fist of rage. And a uh, big uppercut. AOE. Cool. Oh, well, yes. Yeah, lightning uppercut. This is not what I thought the combat in this game would look like. Yeah, this this has been. That's like kind of. I will say so far, the kind of um, unifying thing across the, the, um, get, uh, the different stories is this kind of tile-based combat. This has been kind of the, the, like, at least so far. Um, so let's go, ahead and, let's go ahead and kick this dude in the face. He's, this dude's definitely a little chunkier. All right, so he's going to attack now. Oh, he missed. Suck it. Um, so let's do... Um, this, these do midi, medium damage. Let's do, a, let's do badass kicks. Boot to the head. That's right. Got him, 88 damage, dang. Yeah, big damage. He is a badass biker after all. Seriously? Oh, I got stunned there, I think. It's no good. Uh, so we'll do another, we'll do we'll do a gut punch. Just try and take it. Bam, that's a big hitter. Light, love to see that. Woo! All right, so this guy, so, that, so we'll move towards this guy, as you can see, he has his meter. His, his, this uh, meter. And then though. he starts moving. Yeah, and if he was in, if I was in closer in range, he could have attacked me. Got so it. let's do another lightning, lightning uppercut. Yeah. Boom, easy peasy. All right. That's cool. Yeah, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, it's been it's, the combat's pretty. It's it's simple, but it's but it's fun. Yeah, it, it's different, which I appreciate. You know, it's mm -hmm. not just regular ass turn based combat. <sighs> and that, that's why I definitely like consider overall Thanks, as man. like there's there's definitely a different like rpg back, experience here because like it has some of the staple things from classic like games stupid. but like it Trying has this very different thing. structure of like no these eight my ransom but at least you know i think you know uh, once you complete sister? them all i've heard there's like some kind of final right. arc that maybe Here's connects cool. them but like Jeez. as of right now like uh, everything has been completely separate there's been no real crossover between They're like when i did high. imperial china and i did prehistory it was like completely different cast of characters like no kind of even like overarching Thanks, thing Matsu. that was like happening but between them that like connected them. Why do you anyway. think those guys came They're just like completely different little siloed stories. 
did they finish? Did they feel like they were yes. done when you were yeah, done with they, them? Yeah, they when they when when you finish it, they leave they leave in a way that's like pretty much like an ending to this little story bit. But I'm guessing it's like it kind of just leaves it in the like sort of general place, but like it's not like a they're. I think it's not going to be necessarily they each have their own part twos or something. I think it's more of like maybe these characters will show up some way in some end thing. I don't know. Sure. Okay, let's, I'm going to read his mind right out the gate. I knew they were involved. I knew it. See, it's the Crusaders. All those folks. This proves it. So there we go. He's, he's after the Crusaders for some reason. Let's jump on his bike with him. Let's ride Such out Such a here. moody way to sit on that bike. Yeah. I love it. He's kicking, he's kicking back. There's water that way. There's just nothing. You no, got yeah, okay, he, he turned around. He, he realized Thank God. It. <laughs> it's like, oh crap! Drive right off into the water. Boom! And then, so, yeah, sometimes you just get now. Here's like a bunch of character. Like it's like a little weird late intro. It's the title card, title sequence of the anime episode. This is. I was not. Ex- I was not prepared for this. This. This is some some Kirby Forgotten Lands yeah, level sudden, stuff yeah, going on right like, now. I'm really happy I picked this one. <laughs> Oh, they like that's the the bot, the steel whatever it was. Yeah, because it's, we're, we're literally getting like an anime intro right now. This is kind of amazing. Yes. Yeah, this is very anime. Yeah, look at that guy. <laughs> look at that. Go go, Steel Titan. Steel Titan. That's what's fun. Yeah. Totally like different animation style too, which yeah. is wild. There's all these mysterious things. Mysterious I love it. locales, and then we're heading into our, our house. Amazing. How long were the other two um, campaigns? They, they were pro- they they weren't super long. Like they were probably like two three hours each. Okay. Because I think I'm, I like that. Yeah, because I think I'm my total time is like four and a half hours or so. It's like presumably like twenty to thirty hours for yeah, for all eight. Maybe, maybe which like is not a total, bad. total playthrough. Yeah. It's out of the game for me. So like it's yeah it's it's kind of nice nice to have awesome. like maybe a, a shorter Why not come inside? kind of JRPG experience You're to an right extent. Here. Yeah. So here we go. We're back at a, we're back at this house. Orphanage Please. maybe. Oh yeah, maybe yeah, maybe this is the orphanage. Right, oh yeah, he has some sick music. Bright Sparks Orphanage, yeah, some good jams. Very cool. Oh, clean. Gotta wash your face. Yeah, gotta clean up. Let's, 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 clean let's, the blood let's, off my hands. Ran and beat up all those crusaders. They're done for. All right, let's see what's going on in here. Shout out to that little power outlet next to that door. Very yeah. good detail. Very, yeah, very some good de- good details. Don't tell me for sure. You've been fighting again. Quit freaking out. It's not a big deal. That's right. I'm an angsty youth. It's not a big deal. Home covered in blood isn't a big deal. Dear, dear, your shirt's wrong too. Take it off right now. Wow, this is some anime right here. Hell yeah. yeah that's right. There we go. Oh, it feels like the more laundry I get through, the more laundry there is to do. Endless laundry. Poor Tycho. He mentioned also in the pro like Kauri, a person named Kauri, so I'm curious who yeah, that is. Yeah, yeah, full we'll, uh, sibling or something. Then, so let's, we, so we can, let's see if we can explore around here. It's like a bedroom. Cool. Bedroom it looks like. Let's see what's all going on in here. Oh. This is a classroom from earlier. Yeah, nice. There's a bunch of kids over there. Let's see what's on the TV. Oh, we can't. Dang. No, no TV time over here. What up, kids? I have to read, read, read this kid's mind. Father, when will you come for me? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. Why are you just getting that- into fights? That's Watanabe. Hey, Wasn't he like a child also in the past? Yeah, that's right. What happened? The, I had a growth spurt, apparently. 
I guess. Maybe you're just like a couple years older than these kids. It's wild. Yeah. Poor kids. Get dunked on, Watanabe. Yeah, Shouldn't have gotten up. Sweet time. Uh oh, what happened? What happened? Why? Hey, Broki, your butt kicked. Give me heads up next time, and I'll back you up. <laughs> That's right. Hell I'm yeah, kid. Him to have that little kid come help. Hey, she, she's doing her. Wash my hands properly. I did. I'm gonna read her mind. Kenichi in a while. Uh, bathroom. Let's see, huh, what's this? I got a shampoo hat. I got I got some sweet armor now. Oh yeah, there's, you guys see the menu. Yeah, so there is like uh, inventory stuff, and you can get like equipment and stuff. I put on a hot. I can get some more defense with the shampoo hat. I also cool. have a baseball glove and five accessory slots. Jeez. Yeah, you, yeah, and it's it seems like you, you definitely. I've not gotten that many in, in an individual story, but who knows? Maybe that will will happen at some point. I gotta do some business here. So moody. <laughs> just take some private time, you yeah. Yeah, moody. Yeah, just kick back on the toilet sometimes, you know. Um, all right, let's go see. I think he's in here. Yep. Right, what's, what's going on, Watanabe? Where'd she put it? I'll be watching TV. So bring back whatever you. F I have to find something that one of the kids is looking for. I think. Let's see. Because I'm too cool for help, kid. That's right. Let's read this kid's mind and see if I can figure out what he's looking for. I can't tell if he's can't wearing like thoughts. a tailcoat or a cape. It's one of yeah. the two. It's time for the long-awaited National Wrestling Showdown, and boy, do we have a matchup for you I'm today! Watching some wrestling. Here we go. Miss Sawa, the menacing, and in the blue corner, Muta, the merciless. The time has finally come to witness these two legends of the ring throw down. Prepare yourselves for the unprecedented, a no holds barred, no round limit fight to the finish. And there's the gong signaling the beginning of this le- All right, the bout, the bout has begun. Come on, Misawa, give him the corkscrew elbow. <laughs> oh, she's going off. Got him. She got me. Not You heard, you heard these the, you heard dramatic the kid. kids. <laughs> yep. Oh, uh, he's giving me he's giving me a first aid kit. Sir, nice. Who's winning the rest? Hey, that's my VIP ringside seat you're they sitting. They keep taking each other's spots. Uh oh. Come on, Misawa. Give him what for. Kids, kids being a brat. The corkscrew elbow, or whatever it's called. Yeah, there wasn't any need for sho shoving. Come on. Getting too and into it. that's the end of that round. But neither of these two warriors is showing any sign of... Let's read some more minds. She's too obsessed. She's too obsessed with the wrestling. She cares more about a turtle than she does about me. Oh, I'm sorry. Is it a turtle? They weren't in fight? Kitchy. A turtle. Oh, yeah, let's go. Let's see. Is it a turtle in one of these rooms? I guess. Did I miss a turtle? Oh yeah, here we go. There we go. Oh, oh no. Dying, I think he must be so scared. The poor thing. Damn. Sorry. A lot of childhood trauma going on around here. Can help us out. Doc Toby. You know, the old dude who runs the antique shop. Wait here. I'll go and see what he has to say. All right, let's head. Let's go. Let's go see what this uh, doctor's all about. Doc Tobe. Yeah. All right. Let's yeah, this is what I was here. curious about. Yeah. We have like an over, sort of an overworld this year. Okay. Yep. Oh yeah, and there's some dudes. Oh, there's enemies. Yeah. Hey, let's fight this dude. Come here. The Crusaders are here. 
Oh, okay. Was there an overworld for some of the other? Uh... Uh, n nothing like this. No, it's it was just kind of like a map to map sort of thing. Huh. Overpowering enemies in some battles, groups of enemies may be led by a leader. But defeating this single foe, you're okay. That's that's also new for this one. Cool. I've not had any kind of. So I'm I'm against that main guy. So to teleport in battle, like flee, you can use this to attempt to escape your enemies because you have to yet to master. There's no telling where you'll end up. Interesting. Oh, cool. That's that's new as well. Okay, let's see. Let's go ahead and do. Hit him with the mother shame. Mother shame. The classic. Suck it. <laughs> it's the suck it. All right. I mean, I did a lot of damage to that guy already. Hope he's gonna move his room. A tango. Oh, he healed himself. Okay. Five HP. Oh, yeah, not much. We're just getting in there. We're to mess him up. Boom. Get kicked. And then these guys go down. Easy. They they Easy. disintegrated from your sheer That's strength. That's right. My sheer telepathic strength. Okay. Yeah. So let's go run around here. So let's see if we can go into some of these areas. Too. Oh. I'm at the city docks. So yeah, looks like this this definitely has a lot more areas to go around in than some of the other ones did for sure. Because cool. yeah, those those were more traditional like. I'm I'm just kind of going from left to right or up and down on a on like a kind of you know linear map so to speak. But JRPG wise, for this yeah, there's like a little overworld map. That's cool. That's, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. It's, it's that it, they, these can be that different. All right, let's go for this guy again. Get some hot sax. Yeah, I do music. love this saxophone yeah, this, action yeah, this, right this, now. Yeah, this is, some, this is some pretty good battle music for sure. What is this? I assume like totally different. Than yes. Yeah, they all the have their yeah. music. Yeah, they all have different music for the, each storyline or scenario. Cool. Yeah, it's been it's been that's definitely been a highlight a for badass. me for sure. Is the the music. All right, so it's messing up that guy. Okay, here we go. This is, looks like our antique shop here. This could be that temple, maybe, as well. Oh, yeah, oh this, no, this, this is definitely place. an antique shop. This place? Cool. All right, let's see. I'm gonna read this door's mind! Oh, I think he's... Oh, oh he's yeah, he's, uh... Rest, remember to buy some of those <laughs> nice. Okay, he's using the restroom. Uh, good to know. He doesn't like sit all cool on the toilet like we do. He has to actually nah, use it. Yeah, he's actually got to go. Oh, okay, oh, little older man. If it isn't the orphan boy, pleasure as old. What a nice way to address someone. <laughs> the orphan yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the orphan man. Damn hands. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there it you goes. Gross old man. A yeah, freaking gross old man. Gross. Yeah, no washing hands would not. So, no watching answer will not be tolerated. Today? Deal breaker. Well, in 2022, yeah, absolutely no not. way, no way. What's that you say? Your sister's no. turtle dying. Well, you just leave it in the smooth old to be them broken old clocks and antiques. Let me show you. Tags. Yeah, this guy's yes. He's got some style and uh, yeah. pizzazz. The Cuba educated professional. With the new life. Wow, that's intense. We will teleport ourselves to the orphanage. Uh, okay. I guess people just teleport around in this future. Yeah, huh? it is. It is the near future. I guess teleporting is just a you know cool thing that people can do. I guess. Oh yeah, it just has yeah, it just has a teleporter in the basement. I guess. Let's check it out. What are you doing? Get down from that. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, just jump into it yeah, first. Whatever. See you later. Let's do it. This isn't yeah. gonna go terribly wrong. Yeah, it's gonna go bad. It's about to be a <laughs> Jeff Goldblum situation. I'm trying to the fly. <laughs> Arch, Arch, yeah, that, that's a bad time. Damn. I came, I came out pretty okay though, I guess. Yeah, as long as you're fine. <laughs> yeah. It's like today's <laughs> just not my day. Oh, that's unfortunate. Go on ahead, boy. That's unfortunate. Oh, I 
gotta you gotta read his mind. You yeah, gotta know what's going yeah. on in there. His stupid fucking kid. I knew it would be dangerous. Oh wow. <laughs> he was aware of the risks. He was trying to get yeah. us turned into the fly. He's just trying to get he's trying to take care of this this weird orphan boy. Alright, well what do we do now? Okay, I guess we're just heading back. I guess just go back. Take this guy's this this crusader's butt first. They're weird, like skull masks. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I can't hit him that easily. Just take care of this guy first. Double strike. Suck it. Damn. It's super effective. Yeah, that, that's one thing I will say so far is like, it's not been like super difficult. Yes, um, I've heard this. I, I will say like the pre like there were some. A little bit more challenging things in the pre 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 prehistoric um, uh, storyline I did, but that was more so just like um, not they they kind of have like a little like basic crafting kind of thing in that in that storyline that's just in that and, and like that was like I was not utilizing that enough but once I was once I kind of figured out you can do more with that like crafting specific items that let you let's say I don't know infinitely heal yourself all the time <laughs> but maybe once you find that kind of stuff in there it's like oh okay this this, yeah, this that makes, changes uh, things yeah, huh? changes things a lot huh <laughs> turns out <laughs> but i will say like the on the, way. I'm pretty sure the first one i did too the imperial china was also like it was pretty easy is there like a difficulty option or is it just kind of throw you into it's, it it just kind of just throws you into it i haven't seen any dif difficulty options in the settings or anything uh, in any event, I opted for a less scientific means of locomotion. <laughs> yeah, we, we just walked here. Yeah, it's called feet. Yeah. Let's, see, let's no, help our tur turtle buddy here. Waiting for it to be transformed into a horrible Great monster Scott. we're going to have to fight. Great Scott. There's your first Great Scott. <laughs> yeah, all right. You can tell this was maybe made in a time where that was uh, hot. Yeah. Shout out to the 90s mm -hmm. slash 80s. Oh, that's that's a machine will serve as a host for his liquefacted essence. He's putting this turtle into a robot. No, he's melting the turtle into a liquid essence and then putting that into the robot. <laughs> yes, yeah. <laughs> Which seems questionable. Yeah, this is overly, overly, uh, a little much. I think this is how the Vex were born. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this guy, this guy here made the Vex. Tobe. Uh, okay. <laughs> this guy's just like, all right, I guess I'll go along was, with this. This was Clovis Bray. <laughs> I'm sorry to everyone watching this that does not play Destiny. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just like what now? I'm just, I'm just waiting for this turtle to come alive. Oh, I see. Here's the. Oh, there it is. Give me a sec. I'm plugging it in. <laughs> this little skull. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, he's well, and, and he's dead. Oh, the turtle's alive though. <laughs> Oh my god, is this like one of your party members? That'd be so great. That would be, that would be pretty amazing. Let's see. I, I'll read Turkey his, cheese! Read his, Thank you, Cody. can read his <laughs> mind. <laughs> Jesus. Thank you, Cody. Oh, yeah, I think he is a teammate. Quit following me. Yeah, he, he totally is. Amazing. Your new best friend. A, a turtle robot. That's actually... That actually is pretty pretty amazing. Just, yeah, just don't check on the dog oh, at yeah, all. Just fuck, see you later. Fuck him, dude. Like, whatever. <laughs> oh, he's yeah, fine. He's fine. Just had to brush the dust off. Yeah. Being electrocuted for, like, solid, like, 90 minutes. Let's see. Let's read his mind. Maybe. Just maybe. The steel titan might also be a suitable. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. He has, he has some ulterior That's motives. It. Oh, he's booking it. Maybe a Steel Titan's not bad. Maybe, like, you become... It's like Big O, where oh, you yeah. have a second life as the pilot of the Steel Titan. Yeah, but I use, I use my mind-reading powers to become a mech. A mech superhero. That's right. See, wasn't this kid you? 
<laughs> I'm so confused. Kind, sort of, kind of, yeah. Definitely, they looked similar. Hey, oh, he, he, they were putting him down for a nap. He didn't need any of it. Yeah, he wants to watch this turtle fight or whatever. Yeah, let's see. Oh, hey, hold on. Wash hands. I gotta wash my hands. Also, don't mind this giant turtle robot behind me. <laughs> yeah, it's my new best friend. Okay. Alright, where'd that where'd that kid go? He went he went running off. Is he in one of these rooms? Maybe the classroom. No, not in there. Oh, that's, that's this lady. That's all it's meant to do. Get scraps and a drop of a hat. Okay. Lawless. What a name. Yeah, it's thrown in here. I guess let's go outside and see if that kid ran off somewhere. I didn't put Watanabe. Oh, okay. I have to go maybe talk to some other kids first. Yeah, he, he's in that other room, I think. Yeah, they're all asleep. Oh. It's uh, 3 o'clock, but I mean, is the sun yeah, is shining yeah. through the windows. Here I'll, give, I'll give him, here, I'll give him a... What do I have? I'll give him a grenade. <laughs> I'll give him this light. What kind of snack what is kind that? Of snack is wow, that? all right, kid. Come by the washroom later to discuss our plan there. Sure do. Sure do. Here, here's a grenade. Thanks, but no thanks. Thanks, but no thanks. <laughs> I can't stop. You have like a laxative to give this what kid? Is, what is happening in this? What in the world? Again, okay, that kid's just out. Oh, hey, what's up? You passing out snacks? I got you. Here, I got you. Here's some. Here's here's some robotic enhancements. Go for that. Keep it, dude. And yeah, these kids. Where do we get snacks? These kids are insatiable. Um. Is there something else I missed in the room here? Maybe. Let's see. Maybe maybe now that we've talked to all the kids, we can go. Taco's busy with the laundry now. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go talk to Taco now. Let's see what she has to say. I appreciate it at least tells you at some point what to do. Yeah. <laughs> Laundry's done. Yay. Oh, then she just she just leaves. She's like, all right, I'm out. Some some big Yakuza vibes from this because there's definitely a lot of like orphanage based side quests in Yakuza. Sure. Yeah. Let's see, what else? There's no kids no kids in the toilet. Alright, where did where did Takeo go now? She go would she go to the kids? No. This is... Yeah, I'm so glad you're alive, Terakichi. You're now just a giant <laughs> robot. With bowling ball hands. Yep. And all the kids. Okay, what is... Oh, okay, so now now that she's left. I see. Oh, let's head to the... Let's head to the washroom to find this kid. Oh, I appreciate that the turtle did not come with you. It's very respectful. Yeah. That's, that's, I appreciate that as well. Let's see. Turn on some water. Wait in the toilet. Mm. Here, here he comes. Yeah, I was this close to being busted, but don't worry, I got it. Tycho's dirty little secret. Jesus. Uh oh. A wad of wad well, pocket, pocket lint. Pocket lint. Get back in there and try again. <laughs> no need to be a jerk about it. This kid just stole lint for me. <laughs> Thanks, thanks, kid. I guess. Shout out to Pocket Lint. Got some lint here. I'm gonna try waiting again and see what happens. And see if yeah. that's where maybe, maybe we're supposed to wait here for a little while longer.
Let's see what he's got now. Take his pouch. Let's see if he comes back for more. Just keeps bringing you garbage. <laughs> yeah. What's this? Taiko's picture. Wow. I'm getting a bunch of items here. What's well, Taiko? Let's put, let's put on some equipment. Taiko's picture is, is a. I gave her a hard time, but maybe. There you go. I gave it to the robot. How many party members do you usually get in these? Um, I've had uh, the max I've had is uh, four. Oh, okay. Better get going. <clears throat> I stole some oh, more shit oh, for you. Oh, she, she found it out. What are you two doing in there? Uh, pooping. Definitely pooping. And we got caught. <laughs> the turtle <laughs> robots <laughs> into the corner, just like right? non-conspicuous. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> <Honestly. laughs> <Like> open mouth. <laughs> Oh, I got slapped. Oh! How Damn, Taiko. This? Taiko's furious fist. Got a weapon. Wow. What did you do? Yeah. You got caught, you loser. That's right. Put the she had to be in a bad influence. Yeah, I gotta put on some. Make sure I got the hot uh, equipment on. Alright. So now we can head back out to the city. Maybe we're chasing after Tycho. Or that kid, maybe. Oh, there she's there. on the left, yeah. The friend, fresh sun's in a nice sunny day. La la la. <laughs> Alright, sure. She's not bothered by it. Yeah, anymore. she was. She got she, the, yeah. the slap in, you know. Yeah, she's satisfied. She Alright, let's see where we're heading now. Let's, let's, let's beat up this dude. Let's see what this robot can do. Yeah, what can robot with bowling ball punches do? That's right. Let's see. Oh, wow, there's a lot more now, huh? Yeah, there's a lot more cars here. Let's see, behind you. Freak out enemies so they turn around and look at other threats. Ooh. Let's try it. That's nifty. Yeah. Bet you scare easy. That's right. Nice. Some decent Jesus. damage, too. Let's see what the turtle can do. Tariemo tar punch and Tariemo kick. All right, these have a lot more. Look his shot. mouth. Alright, let's, let's do a Turimo punch. Boom. Oh, <laughs> robots. It's dense. Oh, that thing explodes. Okay, with that. Oh, wow. They, they are like suicide bomb cars. And now I'm. Now the character's dead. So here we go. Well, okay. He's dead forever. Yeah. He's gonna heal. I'm just gonna go for this guy then. Yeah. Uh, yep. Turbo punch. Boom. <laughs> that turtle just barked at that thing. Yeah. <laughs> Terimo. He looks oh, so he's happy like, though. He's like fully leveled too, because he didn't get any experience. It's like bars like right out. Well, that's interesting too. He just made it. Be you have to game. heal after the fight, or do you get all no, your health? No, he, they just heal afterwards. Okay. That's nice. Yeah, it is. that's that is nice. Um, How Final Fantasy thirteen of you? Right. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, it's another stairwell here now. <gasps> Let's see. Has he been? He's, this guy's been hiding something this whole time. It looks like. It's the, it's the steel guy, the steel man, whatever his name was. Yeah. Let's see, if we can keep going down and down here. <laughs> Ooh, secret door. Let's see what's in the door. Oh, yeah, look at this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. What the hell is that? It's the robot. It's the Steel Titan. Look at that. Damn, that looks really cool, too. Yeah, it's a cool, it's, it's pretty cool design. I'm gonna read his mind. It's kind of like Paper Mario-esque. <laughs> Just wants to promote his antique shop for the giant robot. <laughs> sure, why not? This is where we find out the giant robot is an antique. It's from ancient China or something. 
Ancient, apparently. Individual using psychokinesis. Interesting. Ah, I might here know a character go. like that. Okay. Maybe not. Yeah. Oh. That seems that seems like a sus way to do that. Yeah, that seems probably irreversible in a lot of ways, you know? Ah, yeah. oh, did you get the liquefacting surgery? No, thank you. <laughs> no, definitely don't want that, sir. By infusing the Colossus with the liquefacted essence of a human being. If you need someone with superpowers, then I'm your man. That's right. I can read minds, bro. You think you've got what it takes to command it? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Actually, maybe not. In that case, I'll be waiting for you upstairs. Hurry. All right. Let's maybe give this. We we got we got to give this robot mech operating a shot. For sure. I mean, as far as we know, we're the only person with yeah. mind reading powers. So. Yeah, that's right. We have some mind reading powers. We gotta we gotta. Get in and pilot a mech. Why, why turn that down, you know? Maybe Lawless has mind reading powers. Yeah, we're, our Tori tur Emo, our turtle friend here. He's gonna be yeah. a true mech operator. <laughs> <laughs> With his psychokinesis. Right, let's see, let's see what you got. Ready? Good. Fast. You must go and touch my pink elephant. What, excuse and me? After that, you must read a passage from that book next. Yeah, pink elephant can be interpreted in a lot of ways, yeah, my friends. Yeah, afterwards, lay your hands upon the blue mask. Finally, you must return to the basement and offer up a prayer. When you've finished, scrub you your, your hands, hands thoroughly. Head into the washroom and crouch over the toilet. <laughs> Very specific, uh, sort of. Very specific. ritualistic. I All like right, it. So here's the pink, uh, uh, the pink elephant. So I touch the pink elephant. All right, uh, I gotta go read the book. Yeah, read the book. And then the blue mask Red. is there in the the back. Oh yeah, I, yeah, I see blue mask. Touch mask. And then now we must pay our respects. Oh, uh, now we go back to the Titan. You're right. And then we wash our hands, and then we take a dump. Did I skip a step? I must have. Oh, oh well, maybe I, I forgot something. Probably. Yeah. Let's see what. Throw a lot of steps. There, yeah, he did throw a lot of. Sure, you probably ask him. Touch the elephant. Next. Read the book. Strike the xylophone. Strike the xylophone. Oh, I see the xylophone. Okay. All right. So can I? I already did. Price. Let's see. Touch elephant. Start from the top. And it's touch elephant. You can probably you can probably just go to the xylophone then. Did it? All right, the now music, we can get music changed. I think it restarted. Yeah, yeah, it did restart because we played a hot. Oh, I, I skipped a step, I guess. So maybe you do the math. Yeah, I, I wonder if we'll let you just start over. Yeah, let's see. Still, let's, let's give us one more read through here. Good. Fast. You must go and touch my pink, pink elephant. I read a passage. Xylophone, fully mask. You must return to the basement. Yeah, then prayer, finished, and then wash. Your... Let's read his mind also and see what he says. <sighs> Temper your expectations. Okay, so let's try and just. He doesn't believe. Mind. So touch elephant. Oh wait. Good. You must go and touch He's telling us again. You must strike finally. You, when you finished, scrub. Okay. Okay, so he just, he just starts us Ready? over there. Because I think it's. When you finished, I think, yeah, now you can go read the book and then. Yeah, let's try and read the book. Oh, it's, oh, it just tells me, oh, it's blue mask time now. Oh, uh, okay, so as long as you just did the xylophone. Yeah. So I did blue mask. Now I can go pray. 
Shout out to rituals, I guess. Yes, yeah. That this old man yeah, this, came up the, with. The, these bizarre rituals now. So let's go. It is an antique shop. I guess that's supposed to be the. Yeah, that's that's, that's, a, that's a good point. Yeah. Let's, let's head down. Big uh, uncle from Jackie Chan Adventures for energy Absolutely. right now. Absolutely. Let's pray to our robot overlord. Oh, Steel Titan, King Robot of all. Robots. Mechanicalness. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Turtle's like, cool, I'm here too. <laughs> yeah, he's like, well, I don't I don't even know what's going on, man. A second ago I was dying. Now I'm a now I'm a robot. <laughs> yeah. I guess we don't really know what that meant for the turtle also. Yeah, like was he old? <laughs> yeah, right. It's gonna be the big twist as he was he was he just pulled this, this old man just pulled this plot and now the turtle's gonna come back for revenge because he wasn't actually dying. Hands washed. God of the turtle ends up being the big bad. What a terrible world we yeah, live in. Yeah, what a twist. Oh, okay, it's telling me to go in here now. Oh, it's right and then sit on the toilet was the last thing. Yep. There it is. Okay! Stop the music! Oh shit! Here we go. Are we gonna get? Are we gonna get our like? We're we're going inside the the mech now. The toilet was actually a mech elevator. Of course. <laughs> Obviously. This does have like mecha anime sound oh, yeah, to it for sure. Absolutely, this music and everything. The turtle just in the mouth open. Yeah, <laughs> just like what? Yeah. So funny. All right, let's let's see it. Yep, we're in the cockpit. Oh yeah. Use those five levers to control it. Okay, still type us roll out. Let's do it. <laughs> Ow. Oh, uh oh. Okay, Steel Titan. Let's roll out. Let's roll out. It's giving me the spins. Uh, yep. Yeah. yeah, I guess you keep trying the levers. Yeah. Try this one. Steel Titan, let's roll out. I believe. <laughs> oh, maybe not. This is this is working out so far. One of these is definitely gonna be it though. Yeah, this has gotta be it. Oh. Nice. Alright, All just right. like the, the, the close last, left one. Let's try oh, this yeah. Last one here. Okay, steel tight, let's roll out. Let's see what happens. Oh, uh, just turn the lights out. Whoops. What happened? No, good, huh? So it goes. All right, Kurt Vonnegut. Oh, uh, well, I mean, uh, we guess we're just giving up. Maybe we need to to get five people in true mecha anime fashion. It's true, me. Yeah, maybe we need a whole squad of people. Yeah, we need to, uh, to get these orphans in this robot. <laughs> yeah. All the kids. Yeah, that's right. That's going to be all the kids that are going to get in this robot. If you come across anything interesting, your memory inspiration can be we found, found even, even in, in the, the banal. And the non there you go. Item upgrades. You can give Dr. about items and ask him to improve them. It's just so you present you with a new item, but these messes are unpredictable. There's no time to come with. Nevertheless, you may be pleasantly surprised. Interesting. Okay. Well, that's that's a, a good look at this one little portion here. Yeah. I think of live alive. I've seen that there's a lot of other stories in this game, but I figured you know this this just game pick one and roll with this, it. This, yeah. Just pick one and roll with it. And again, I I don't know. I've not really looked up how the later part of the work. I've just heard like there is like a once you complete all eight, there is some kind of ending thing that opens up. And that's maybe where your connecting tissue is for these characters and things. So 
it seems like there will be something, but I have no idea like what that all entails. But I think I, I'm yeah. enjoying this this parts of the game enough that I do kind of maybe want to see what that is. And that's cool. I'm appreciating all of these like Easy as hell. like these like like the, this being a sort of like proto Octopath Traveler and the things I liked about Octopath Traveler where it was like this this game about these different characters and telling these interesting stories and being able to spend more time with individual characters rather than it just being a little bit more typical when it comes to a JRPG, right? Where you have kind of that, that you know, ragtag group where all of a sudden it, it's kind of more about a main plot rather than these individual characters. So yeah. Like, I appreciate it from that perspective uh, for sure. And I know that game had the problem of like not tying any characters really together. Yeah. So if this can pull it off, that'd be cool. Yeah, I, you can definitely see like the proto kind of chrono trigger yes. uh, vibes too. Cause a lot of this team would go on to make chrono trigger. Yeah, um, for sure. But yeah, all the different time periods and stuff. That's definitely that vibe. It's cool. Plus, it just looks and sounds great. Yeah, it's definitely getting the HD 2D glow up. I definitely think is a, a great thing for this game. So let's kick this Crusader yeah. in the butt. <laughs> just disintegrates into yeah, dust. Yeah, kick him so hard he just disintegrates. Absolutely brutal. It was a badass. That's that's my Akira guy um, from Live Alive. But yeah, thanks Alex for joining yeah, me. Yeah, thanks for showing off, Mike. And thanks everybody for watching. We'll see y'all next time. Bye. Bye.